So hey, how are you? I hope everything is going good. I hope everything is going amazing. So as you can see by the title of this video, I'm here to talk about weight loss today. That's what we're going to talk about because I haven't talked about it for almost two months. And as I said in that video a couple weeks ago, it is a part of my world and uh, I'm going to talk about it. I'm just going to talk about it when it's time, when it's, you know, the proper time. So there are no new updates as far as weight loss. I think I've lost maybe like four or five pounds and since the last video I don't even remember I didn't check um, before I wrote I started recording this but um, yeah I don't think I've lost very much in the past two months but I know that that's partly because I have been out here enjoying the summer uh, drinking like a fish which I'm gonna get back to the drinking in a minute but um I've been just living my life and enjoying myself and I'm not complaining at all look I'm having fun but um, I do need to get myself together because I have been kind of procrastinating on this surgery thing um, just because I really didn't know when I wanted to do it I didn't know if I even still want to do it this year um, I feel like I was kind of rushing it along because it's just been a year um, I think this past this last week because I got out of the hospital a couple of days before 4th of July last year since I had the paniculectomy so I didn't want to rush into a um, breast reduction um, surgery or anything like right after so um yeah I've been kind of you know just relaxing and knowing that that surgery is going to be there I need to kind of cut um at least like 20 more pounds off of my body before the surgery but I do need to start strengthening my body because I feel super weak which part of the reason for that is because I haven't been able to work out I feel like I injure myself so much in the past year um, I feel like my ankles are just like we are over you <laughs> you have you have made us endure entirely too much um, so we're done you know because I told you guys um, a couple of videos ago that I injured my ankle I re-injured it again. I'm not sure if it's the same injury, which I'm pretty sure it is, um, because it was still kind of sort of hurting around the 4th of July, but I was able to move around. Um, I still was uncomfortable for me to wear sneakers or like shoes, like enclosed shoes. So I've been dealing with that again. I've been really relaxing. It's getting better, so I'm not complaining at all. It is doing much better than it did the first time. Everything is good. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like I've just been in a real funk when it comes to this weight loss thing. I feel like I'm in one of the valleys. You know, I've hit the peaks and now I'm hitting the valleys. And um, I haven't really been able to bounce back from this one. Uh, so I wanted to come post this video just to show you that there are two sides. I know a lot of times I get on here and I say to find your balance and to find something that works for you. But even when you find your balance, because I mean, I've been doing this for a long time. Um, it's still very difficult to keep it going, to keep the momentum going, especially when life gets in the way, because I have so many things that I want to do in life, you know, and that I'm focusing on in life, um, that it is really just, I don't know, it's just taking over my brain. And, and I have the type of brain where I work, I'm very tunnel vision with something. So when I throw myself into work, I tend to kind of slack off on other things. So listen, it's just... I don't know I just wanted to be transparent and I wanted to upload this video to say that listen weight loss is hard as fuck okay it is hard to maintain for a long period of time and I feel like now that I'm within 100 pounds of my goal this shit is so hard it's so difficult one of the hardest things that I have to deal with right now um is just getting the rest of this weight off man like I I don't know. I'm, I'm too hard on myself, so I try not to think about it, and I try to remember that I'm moving at my own pace. I'm, I'm, I'm at the pace that I that I'm supposed to be going, and as long as I focus on that, it helps. But it's still hard. It's still fucking hard. <laughs> I hadn't updated you guys in a while as far as the weight loss. I hadn't really talked weight loss on this channel. I'm probably gonna talk weight loss more um, because. I need to get focused. I really do. I need to get focused. I'm going to stop drinking, which brings me back to the drinking thing. I'm going to stop drinking. I didn't explain this before. Probably the first 
eight years of this whole entire journey, I didn't have a drink of alcohol, a drop. Because I know me and I know I love a good little cup of bourbon with two pieces of ice in a in a Mickey glass. I love it, you know? Um, and I know that that's very distracting for me. So um, I, I need to cut it out. Um, as far as going out with friends and stuff like that, I have like two more weekends where I have to go out as birthday related stuff. Like this upcoming weekend, um, I have to go out and then... Um, I think one other weekend I have to go out, and other than that, I'm I'm going clean for the remainder of the year until my own birthday. So, well, scratch that. I'll be going out of town a couple of times uh, between now and my birthday, so I'm probably gonna eat bad. But listen, balance, balance. Remember I said that. But I'm gonna try to do my best to cut this this 20 pounds off in the next month or so. I'm gonna pace myself. I'm not gonna go like extreme, you know, uh like I tend to do. So I'm gonna pace myself and just really start focusing on my water, letting my ankle get better and start doing my walks again and you know maybe start incorporating a little bit of strength training. I'm trying not to talk too much about this because I feel like every Every time I say I'm about to go hard in the gym or I'm about to really get into my workouts, my ankle fucks up. So I'm just going to shut my mouth and be quiet about it. This is just a quick little update though. Uh, that's all I got for this video. Click the thumbs up on your way out. Subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment down below telling me some like, what do y'all do to stay encouraged? Like what do you do to get like motivated again on your weight loss? I'm pretty sure most of the people that follow me follow me for the weight loss stuff or you guys are on your own journey or have been through some type of journey. So tell me what you do down in the comments below to re-motivate yourself. I would really, really appreciate it. Um, uh, that's all I got for this video though. I'll see you guys next week. Peace.